guys in this simple simulation tutorial i will explain that how we can use the potentiometer or a variable resistor within the tinkercad for it just go to the right hand side and here you can see that basic and all components so you can click on basic and here you can see that you have this potentiometer okay so potentiometer's function is just to increase and decrease the resistance by rotating its knob and we can see that we have one knob on the on just the top of the potentiometer now variable resistor is the synonym to the potentiometer okay so we will like we we will take one resistor okay okay so we will also take one one three volt battery cell now we will connect the cathode of the led with that of the negative or ground of the coin battery cell now we can see that like we can do one thing like we need to connect its positive with the wiper pin the middle pin is actually the wiper pin of the potentiometer so it will look like this so now we will attach any other terminal to the positive side of the led okay now we will run it and we will see that okay now when now now you can see that our knob is at lowest point now we are going to increase it in here you can see that the leds just just going to be off okay so yeah We can do one more thing that we can increase the battery voltage by connecting two cells with each other the negative to the positive of one and we need to connect them in series like this so their voltages will be doubled or two times Of this, here we can see that now oh, it's, uh, it's going to destroy the LED. Okay, we, we can change its value. Uh, we can change the value to to like uh, 250 ohm to like simple ohm okay so like this so okay so we need to start the simulation okay now at this point okay we are going to destroy it and here you can see that or we, we, we can do one more thing that we we can take this resistor and we will like uh, import their bulb because it can respond better to our okay so yeah 
here you can see that its brightness is controlled with the help of this knob movement so here like now it's full and after it it is going to slow so this is the basic tutorial that how we can use the potentiometer so here it can reduce the voltage like it can drop the voltage inside it it can reduce the amount of current flowing through through it or going to the load so this is the basic function or functionality of the potentiometer so thanks for watching